Hello everyone, this is David from Automotive Press. From purely engineer's perspective, minivans actually make way more sense than traditional SUVs and crossovers. In fact, I think minivans like this Honda Odyssey is simply more practical and actually drives better too. So let me give you seven reasons why I think minivans such as this Honda Odyssey is simply better and more practical and makes more sense than your traditional SUVs and crossovers. Okay, so I am going to talk about why I think minivans makes more sense than SUVs. But before I do that, let's do a quick uh, engineer's audit on this new 2022 Honda Odyssey, which I'm really enjoying. Uh, I'm going to first of all make sure that the tire pressures are okay. So I did that already and adjusted the tire pressure for all four tires by, by about two PSI or so. So that's all adjusted. And I'm going to do my usual paint check, which is uh, using a paint uh, thickness gauge to see if the quality of the paint is good and whether there's enough paint on the car. And finally, I'm going to do a quick body check to see the, what the tolerances are like and whether or not the panels are aligned together. So we'll do a quick check on these things right now, and then I'll talk about the seven reasons why these things make more sense than SUVs. Okay, so first let's check the paint thickness using a paint thickness gauge. And basically it should be between 100 to 180 microns. And the reason why this is important is because the thickness of the paint kind of indicates the overall quality of the paint thicker the paint, of course, the better. In the case of this Honda Odyssey, I'm actually surprised that uh, it's a little bit thicker than normal, about 20% thicker than other cars I've tested at about 150 micron in the front here, 130 on the side, so it's also a little bit thicker. I did check all the way around, and generally speaking on this Honda Odyssey, the paint thickness is between 130 and 150. So it's about 10 to 20% thicker than other cars I've tested, which is a good thing. And the paint quality, when I checked it from front to back, in terms of the gloss, uh, orange peel, the amount of a clear coat, you know what? It's actually fantastic. I'm shocked at how good and how much of a first class paint job they did with this Honda Odyssey. So super happy with the paint job. Now let's check to see if the body alignment and the panel fit is as good as the paint job. So now we're going to check the uh, body alignment and the quality of the fit and finish of all these different panels. And how I do that is simply to check for the consistency of the gap and to see what the width of the gap is. So you want the gap to be sort of four to six millimeters, not much more than that. And the better fit the panels are, the more likely the better overall quality is for the whole car. So it's really important to test for that. I use a couple of different gauges here, depending on the, which section of the car. But on this Odyssey, I was actually quite surprised that uh, in terms of the hood to the front fender ratio, it's probably one of the best I've seen in the last two or three years. It's only about three and a half millimeter gap, and it's almost a perfect fit from front to the back of the hood almost unheard of in this price range. And I also checked the, uh, the width of the gaps in the door. It's about four millimeter here and about 3.9 millimeter here and about the same for rest of the uh, door panel. So both in terms of the paint job and uh, body fit and finish and panel alignment, this is probably one of the best I've actually seen for many years. And so I'm very impressed with the manufacturing quality of this Honda Odyssey. Now let's get into that. Seven reasons why I still think this Odyssey and the minivans in general make more sense than buying your SUVs. As you know, most SUVs are based on car-based unitized body anyways. So when you look at SUVs, crossovers, station wagons, and minivans, there aren't as much differences as you think anymore, in terms of engineering anyways. But the telltale sign that minivans are still a little bit different than SUVs is the um, sliding doors, which of course makes so much more sense from engineer's perspective. I know this is what makes minivan look like minivan and perhaps that is not necessarily a fun thing because image is everything these days and a lot of people don't want to be associated with minivans for whatever reasons. But again, from technical perspective, 
I mean, this makes so much more sense. It slides open. It doesn't swing open to another car beside it. It's wide opening, so that's easy to get in and out like this. And uh, for everyone, whether it's for uh, adults or for kids, this is the reason why minivans make more sense than SUV, or at least the first point. The second point is the practicality and the versatility of this minivan. Look how much space we get. The front seats are comfortable. The second seats are super roomy and comfortable with a flat floor. And even a third seat is super usable. And even if you're a very tall person, you can actually sit in the third row and be comfortable. You cannot get that in most three-row SUVs. So this design and the way that it was engineered to accommodate family and as a people mover, it kind of just makes sense. The third reason why minivans like this Honda Odyssey makes more sense is simply because you get more value for your money. It's cheaper than most SUVs that have three rows because they moved upscale, and you get lots of features and lots of content. So it really is a value leader in terms of buying a family or people mover. The fourth reason why I really like this Honda Odyssey as a minivan is simply because it drives better than most SUVs. It's very agile, uh, it has a good road feel, the steering is just right, and almost kind of feels like a sports sedan. Compared to larger SUVs that are sometimes bumpy and difficult to drive and not all that fun to drive, in fact, this thing is way better. In fact, if you were to ask me, would I prefer to drive a, a big SUV or this one as a daily driver, I'm going to take this one for sure because it's actually quite fun to drive and I'm really enjoying it. Good braking, really good uh, engine feel, um, solid transmission shifting. You know what? Really well engineered from the, from the Honda side and uh, I think this thing will outrun most SUVs and even larger three-row crossovers out there. So fun to drive factor is definitely one reason why the Honda Odyssey and minivans simply makes more sense. The fifth reason why this Honda Odyssey makes sense is kind of related to the fourth reason, which is the fact that it rides really well. It's ultra smooth, very comfortable, quiet, almost like a luxury car. You know what, it's kind of almost like a Lexus level of ride and um, drive feel. So for passengers especially, they're going to love being in this Honda Odyssey compared to a large SUV that's sometimes very bumpy and not all that comfortable, especially over rough roads. This thing is definitely better overall. So I think it's more comfortable, it drives better. It just kind of makes sense. The sixth reason why minivans make sense, especially this one here, the Honda Odyssey, is because you get cool features that are typically not available on other SUVs. So for example, we get two features here called cabin watch and cabin talk. Cabin watch is very simple. It's basically kind of a, a bird's view perspective uh, of the second row and the third row. So you can see what's going on in the back for your kids or whoever else is sitting back there. And then cabin talk is when uh, your voice is amplified so that people can hear from the back uh, without you speaking loudly. So that allows you to have a conversation and uh, people can actually hear you clearly. And these features are typically not offered in other SUV, but you do get them in the Honda Odyssey. You can even flip the third row seat at the back, so it kind of becomes like a tailgate party. Uh, so those are some of the cool features I find in this Honda Odyssey. The seventh reason why I like minivans like this Honda Odyssey better than SUVs is simply because there are lots of practical designs that engineers have built into the car. So for example, the glove compartment is huge, the, all of the cup holders are oversized, even the center console has uh, lots of multifunctional usage and big space in the center here. You even get two tiered um, door pockets as well as two tiered back seat pockets as well. So those are all the stuff that you get in this particular minivan that sometimes is overlooked or not offered in other SUVs. So I just gave you several reasons why I think as an engineer the Honda Odyssey and minivans in general actually make a lot of sense compared to SUVs. But of course there are reasons why you might still want to buy an SUV. So for example the Odyssey does not come in all-wheel drive and is clearly not suitable for off-roading. As well, minivans in general are not selling all that well, so maybe the resale value wouldn't be as good. And compared to say, let's say a Toyota Sienna, 
it doesn't come in hybrid either. So there are some reasons where uh, SUVs or other um, crossovers might make more sense. But personally, I'm surprised how much I enjoy driving and actually using this Odyssey for the week because I think it just makes so much more sense. Well, I hope this was helpful. A lot more videos to come your way. Thank you so much for watching, but for now, I'm signing off.